Shark. You got fans everywhere, huh? Yeah. I guess. Even to the boat race. Six shorts. Yeah, thanks. I cut them. I cut them before I left. You know, we. You know, I figure since I'm in the Florida sunshine, I might as well, you know, get the legs out, get a little tan on them. Yeah. You know, summertime's approaching quick in Oklahoma. I don't want to be. You know, I don't have all these white legs out of the pond when I'm bass fishing. What are we doing here? What is this thing? I don't know. Like, I'm in um, for the boat, right? If you flip over in a boat, you gotta, like, know how to hold your breath underwater while it's upside down. So, I don't know. It looks like a little carcass. Like, it's just gonna simulate if we were to flip over when we're on the water. And they wanna make sure that I can, like, not freak the f out. Because usually when you're trapped underwater upside down, you, you freak out. You're usually a really calm person, though. So oh, you're yeah. Gonna... You know, calm, cool, collected. Those are three. Three words that um, really describe me. So I should be all right. I'm not too worried about it. Look, I felt a shark. <laughs> Get me out of here. Help. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> You all right, Ronnie? I think that went pretty good. Don't there you? you? Go. All right, we're ready. We're ready to go racing. We're ready to go racing. <laughs> right on. Yeah, I think it was good. You know, I kept calm, cool, under control. No big deal. Hey, Ron, it smells like fish in here. No, it smells like your mom's house. <laughs> that ain't no good, Ron. Yeah, ain't no way, Oh, you know Dude, I've watched so many of you. I've been into dirt bikes for almost three years now. If we want to make some sweat, we got to drink some beers, right? Sweat equity. Oh, the cute puppy doggy. Yes. His or her? Who is it? Him? Him? What's his name? Gizmo. Oh, well, you got some nice puppies. I mean, you got a nice puppy. I swear. Oh, what a good doggy. Right on. Take care, guys. Let's go, brother. Cheers. Right. Cheers, huh. queers. <laughs> God, Ron always wins. Ron's on top, oh, baby. God. Ron's on top. What? Oh, no. <laughs> What's in here is a bunch of goodness is what it is. It's, it's the new cooler that's coming out on Memorial Day. And, uh, you know, it... It says it only holds 12 beers. Man, I swear so, I fit about So a you are a red, white, and blue guy? <laughs> my son and my grandson are, would be dressed like you at all times. Good. Can I get a picture with you? They must be real patriots. They then. wicked 100% are. Wicked. You, you wicked. Take, wicked. I'm just saying. That guy. How about that guy? Oh, yeah. I can't reach it. Get him. <laughs> It's creepy. I can't see shit. All right, there we go. I can see you now. Yeah, that was a little bit weird. A little bit slimy. Blech. Like your what? Like like my what? Like your what? Like my cock? My cut. Come on, my cut. Well, time to restock the cooler. See how much fun we've been having. Oh yeah, I got a fresh bag of ice. We're That's running low on tequila. All these beers, that's just water. We got one more left in here. Yeah, but I guess um, I guess they're gonna make me wear one of their uh, one of their official race helmets because they're worried about me damaging my brain more. Um, so we gotta do some stickers on that that's right cool. now. Well, we're gonna have like six or nine bubbles. I'd say that's pretty much a success. Standard. Since we in a boat and we're so damn close to the ocean, um, this is gonna be now called the Screaming Seagull. You're Ron's teammate? Yes, sir. Are you driving or throttling? I'm throttling the boat today. All right. Greg's going to be driving and Ronnie's going to be pointing us where to go. Oh, God. Yeah, it's pretty scary. <laughs> I'm pointing them straight to the finish line first. All right, 
Alright, good luck. I don't know man I think I think I'm gonna race in a boat two times my very first time racing a boat my very last time racing a boat because I was nuts I mean we were we were probably in the boat for like I said maybe 69 seconds in the race going and two guys slipped over and bodies flying outside of boats uh -uh. I was afraid I was never gonna taste the sweet sweet taste of a cold PBR ever again but you know, it's, it's good. That's what racing's all about is, you know, letting your butthole pucker up a little bit. That's what it really is all about. If your butthole ain't puckered, you ain't doing it right. Does that taste better now <sighs> after you're like almost died? Dude, yeah, anything tastes better now. Shit, I love it though. Whatever. Can I have one? I, I would say, um, absolutely you can have one, Brian. I'm, I'm, trying, I'm, to get, I'm trying to stick I'm, I'm so these. proud of you. I'm so proud of, see now, Life's just getting better and better. We didn't die today. Brian's drinking PBR. Things are looking up. I don't know if you're gonna be happy, but I, I got a ticket on the scooter. See, you know what? This, this is a bullshit ticket, though. I'm gonna let you know because I was talking about that in there. You were on a 49 cc bike, and you got a ticket for being on the sidewalk. Let's just put this here. I mean, I'm, I'm not the smartest guy ever, but. I was told once that if it's 49 cc's or lower, it's considered a fucking bicycle. And uh, you can't get a ticket for riding on the sidewalk on a bicycle. So that cop can just go screw right the hell off. Let us know in the comments if it's legal or not. Is it legal to ride a 49 cc bike on the sidewalk? I was in the bike lane. The bike bike lane? Well, yeah. yeah. And you were in the bike lane, not even the sidewalk? That's not even as dangerous. Yeah, no. <laughs> yeah, write in the comments below. Are we, are we breaking the law or are they being assholes? Either or. Yeah. <laughs>